Why does the tree fund exist? People need trees, and trees, especially urban trees, need people. Curious, passionate, educated people. John Davy launched the science of arboriculture in 1901 with his book, The Tree Doctor. More than a century later, the Tree Fund is encouraging discovery and cultivating innovation through scientific research. Highland Johns has been a supporter since the beginning. My vision, along with all the others who were founders of this Tree Fund, really had a tremendous drive to support research, education, and scholarship. And we were hoping to put it on a sustainable basis to improve the quality of the research and direct it to become more practical so that it could be used by the people in the field, the tree workers. Trees are critical to the health of our communities, but healthy urban trees don't just happen. Tree Fund Research provides arborists with proven solutions to tackle tree care's tough problems and practical strategies for keeping our neighborhood shaded and green. It all comes down to funding. There are a large number of researchers that are working on tree problems, but not enough to address all the, the questions. I'm sure there are a number of young researchers waiting in the wings, waiting for opportunities to expand their research program. And when I was a, a young researcher, just getting out of graduate school, these small grants were invaluable allowing me to get my research program started and in determining the direction that I would ultimately go. We're doing a lot of research in working towards improving those soil conditions. But we've also been looking at some new organic products and one product that we've been looking at quite a bit is biochar. It improves the, the soil's ability to hold on to water and nutrients and it also is a very, very good habitat for soil microorganisms. Safety continues to be Tree Care's top priority. We can't learn fast enough how to keep our workforce safe and how to minimize risk to people and property from tree failures. Well, this is tree biomechanics research. Trees are moving constantly in the wind and the whole objective is to understand really when trees are safe. We put a black and white speckle pattern on these trees and that speckle pattern gets tracked by sets of stereo cameras. The fancy term is uh, stereo photogrammetry that uh, means we're using 3D images of things to, uh, in this case, trees, to track the movement of that tree as it responds to forces of wind, or in this case, our simulated wind by cabling the tree and pulling on the cable. As a foundation, our role is to look to the future. Where will tomorrow's arborists and researchers come from? How do we persuade today's kids to care about the environment? For starters, we get them outside. We are going to be going to the prairie and the forest today. The prairie is a grassland. There's a lot of tall grasses. You'll see some plants and some shrubs. Spread out, look for cool stuff. You may go explore. Can someone remind us some of the things that we're gonna be looking for a nest, excellent. Excellent, a hole in the ground, and there are some out there, yes. Something that smells, Something that smells good. It smells like dead leaves. <laughs> Let's go again! <laughs> Thank you for awarding our high school the Highland R. Johns Grant in the spring of 2012. You have given over 50 high school students the opportunity to do research on how different soil amendments affect the establishment of autumn blaze maple trees. The tree fund is the sole reason I entered the world of arboriculture and I really cannot picture myself anywhere else. So thank you so much for this opportunity and I cannot wait for my future in arboriculture. For every research grant we award, at least three others are passed over due to a lack of funding. We have bright scientists on deck waiting to produce tree care's most important tool, knowledge. Join me in supporting the science that keeps our planet green. Ultimately, healthy trees are rooted in research and we all have a stake in the results. All we are saying is give trees
is a chair.